in just about one more click you will recognize what this organ is if you haven't already if your eyes are good enough to be picking up all these little balls as, as glomeruli then you already know that we're in the kidney and so you could see glomeruli and you could see tubules and you could see tubules in the collecting system but the first thing that might hit your eye is that within the area which is predominantly tubular uh, perhaps inside of a medullary, uh, inside of the medulla, inside of deep within a pyramid, you see little irregular areas as well. And when you look closely at these areas, like here, 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 relative to the normal surrounding tubules, the first thing that you notice is that they may be tubules, but you can't really make out their cytoplasm and nuclei very well like you can in the tubules surrounding them. These are necrotic tubules. This is not blood. It doesn't look like blood, but it's about as red as blood. These are necrotic individual tubules. And now that you know that they're all over the place and they represent all of these areas uh, within the medulla, you might go out to the cortex in which you see a good number of um, glomeruli as well and look at some of those tubules. And you can see a glomerulus here. You could see some tubules here, even at this power, which you're wondering if you could discern nuclei or not. No, you really can't. You could see completely the nuclei within here and within here, but look at these tubules, probably proximal tubules. You can't see nuclei at all, and furthermore, the cytoplasm is a lot redder than it should be. These are necrotic uh, tubules as well. And here is a part of the tubule where you could at least uh, see some residual cells. But almost all of this tubule and almost all of this one is also necrotic. This is tubular necrosis. Tubular necrosis has a very, very long list of a differential diagnosis, uh, many of which are vascular and many of which are toxic. And in this case, uh, certain toxic compounds like ethylene glycol antifreeze, uh, besides wreaking severe havoc, on the uh, multiple areas of the body, one thing that it does is it kills your tubules. And could this possibly be some crystallization of the compound? I would rather not guess because I don't know. But besides necrotic tubules in here, you see something else that doesn't look like it should be there. This is acute tubular necrosis. We can see it in the cortex in an area where there are nearby uh, glomeruli but we can also see it out in an area uh, within the medulla uh, as well. And in this case, it is caused by one of the many uh, poisons that can uh, do direct damage to the tubules. In this case, it's ethylene glycol causing acute tubular necrosis. I thank you very much.